Barry, like your team's uh, desperation playing against a team that was hungry for points? Yeah, yeah, that was a that was a fast hockey game. Both teams, uh, I thought, played uh, pretty well. I, I liked the the first two periods. I thought we did a really good job frustrating them, and we just those are dangerous hockey games because I thought we had uh, some real good chances to pull away, and we didn't. And then you know they they hang around. So uh, big goal, uh, obviously by Nelly, and then uh, big penalty kill, and some big saves that we needed, and we got it done. Just uh, defensively, you know, it seems like two games where you kind of got back to your structure a little bit. And what, what is having Johnny Boychuk back in the mix kind of do towards that end? Well, I think uh, I think you know Johnny's one of those guys that uh, I say analytically, they're you know, or, or or the visual is not always pretty. But when it comes to what he, what those intangibles, those those big moments, you need to someone to block a shot or. You know, uh, sacrifice himself. Uh, you know, the battles in front. He's he's that's what he does, and uh, I think he brings a an energy to the room. And uh, you know, there's a reason why he's one of our leaders. So, Tanner Fritz today uh, seemed like he brought a lot of energy on the PK, just in the game overall. What have you seen from him since he's been up? Seems like well, he's been a shot of energy. There's a couple things. A's you know, obviously his speed is undeniable up front. Uh, I think he's uh, the more he's playing, he's uh, added. You know, he's adding trust to his game. You know, you can play him. Uh, uh, he's he's looks like he's playing confident. Uh, he's doing a good job in the penalty kill. Uh, his faceoffs are pretty good, and and he's uh, you know he's he's just playing. I think he's playing with a lot of that uh, the confidence and energy that you look for, especially when people go down. And uh, we had someone go down, and he was playing down uh, in. Uh, Bridgeport and playing very well, and it's, show, it's showing in his game up here. It's a great opportunity for him. It really is. I mean, uh, you know, he's uh, one of those young men uh, that you, you meet and you, you know he's he's uh, doing everything he can to, to be the, the best he can. Does a uh, four-point weekend like this allow the guys to exhale a little bit? Not in a little better spot, uh, uh, or is it too early for that? No, I, I don't think there's any exhale. I think it's just staying on. I think our guys understand, um, uh, you know, we just, right after the game, obviously we, we have a quick chat, and it just feels right. It feels right the way we play. When you play right, it feels right. And you don't really worry about the score as much, about the, you know, the, you know what ifs. What if we don't play well? Yeah, we just play, and then we play. We can frustrate teams. We can get on you, um, and, it, and, the, and the results sort of come. And uh, um, it, we, our bench was fantastic today. I mean, it, it, it could have been, you know, you're you're pushing and pushing. You had some chances, and it could have been maybe, you know, two or three nothing after two, and and they're still hanging around. They get a, a chance here or there, and you know your bench could turn, but they they didn't. They just stayed on it and defended. And, and made good decisions. We got a big goal and at a great time. And it, what I like is our, our our leadership. You know, you look at last game, who really stepped up. But you know, it was it was uh, then you know Bailey, Nelson, Lad was really good. Uh, that line was good the last couple nights. And you know, you got Anders Lee and all. You know, all of a sudden the, the veteran guys at the very important time are really. You know, stepping up. We they they had gone dry for a little bit, and we have success as a four-line team. And I thought everybody contributed.